So what, what is Article 73 of the TRIPS agreement? Uh, it goes to, to essential security interests. So it says, uh, as you can see on the screen, nothing in this agreement shall be construed to prevent a member from taking any action which it considers necessary for the protection of its essential security interests. Uh, so before we move on to the next phrase, as you can see, uh, the wording of, of Article 73 uh, is, you know, in, in this context, the, the first part of it at least is fairly self-judging. So it's for nations to decide for themselves what they think is necessary for the protection of their essential security interests. So I think Article 73 uh, on its plain language sort of allows countries to frame for themselves uh, what, what their essential security interests are and to sort of assert what they think is necessary uh, to protect those interests. But then, then comes the snag, and I think that's where, you know, the, the real legal analysis w would, would um, come in for this particular issue is, you know, it must be taken in a time of war or other emergency in international relations. And so much of the focus that I'm, you know, that I'm going to, much of what I want to pay attention to today is, is on that phrase, uh, because I think that would be the, the phrase that, you know, brings this article into operation or not in this particular context. So, you know, is the COVID-19 pandemic, uh, it's certainly not taken in, in time of war, or at least not global war, but is it an other emergency in international relations? Mm -hmm.